Today we're going to be doing an unboxing of the Best Self Journal, and I also got what are called Smart Marks, which are their big paper, I'm guessing post-it, stick it like bookmarks. So let's go ahead and open it, see if it's worth it, and whether or not you should get one. Hi everyone, I'm Lisa from Pretty Fabulous, and I help online businesses create beautiful digital downloads using Adobe InDesign. So if this sounds like you or something you might be interested in, make sure to hit the subscribe button below. I post new videos every Monday and Thursday. All right, so I looked at the best self journal because I was really curious to see what it looked like in person, in the flesh, and also I had heard a lot of great things about it. So. What I did, the first thing is I had to decide whether or not it was worth buying from the website itself versus buying from Amazon. And let me share that with you before we open it. Um, so over here on Amazon, you can see that it was $51.98. And that's because I have Amazon Prime, so it was free. It came in one day, it was next day delivery. And over here on what is called the best self website, it was $57.48. And that was with the cheapest shipping method, which is FedEx Ground, and that was going to take four business days. So if you don't have Amazon Prime, this might be a good option, but if you do have Prime, then you're much better off with just buying it directly from Amazon, and that's even with the price being different. So over on Amazon, you can see that the journal itself was $39.99 versus over on the Best Self website, the journal is $31.99. Now, the same thing happened with the bookmarks. Those were $11.99 on Amazon versus those were only $9.99 on the Best Self site. So at first glance, it seems like Best Self is going to be a way better deal, but that is not the case at all. You are much better off purchasing it from Amazon, uh, not from Best Self. So let's go ahead and open it. And I have an X-Acto knife, but I don't think it needs that. It just has a pull tab. And it's pretty tight over here. There's like not a lot of room to give. So let me go ahead and open it. So just like all Amazon, I think Amazon does an excellent job of packaging and fulfilling things. Um, so it comes in shrink wrap. So we do need our X-Acto knife. So let's go ahead and open up the bookmarks first. And I don't wanna ruin this, so. Okay, so when we pull this out, it has, uh, it has a cute little pocket folder, I guess, right in here, and it has nothing else in there. And you actually get two, no, I lied, three sets of smart mark bookmarks. So I'm not sure if you can see these, but these bookmarks, um, let me try to hold them up to the other screen. So these basically just say, smart marks along the left and over here it says book title it has um just lines and it has a little gray overlay here that says page so you i guess know which page you're going to refer back to but i was wrong this is not like a post-it note it is simply stapled together here in the center and this entire thing must go inside a book as your entire bookmark um so that's okay they're not post-its. Uh, this is the self journal. All right. So this is a, it looks like it just opens up. Oh, it has a little magnet here on the side that kind of keeps it shut. So inside of here, it looks like we have, I'm guessing this is like a bookmark. Um, we have the self journal, which is simply, this is just a card. And on one side it says morning ritual, uh, evening ritual, action, and then how much time you're estimating that it will take or either what time you will be doing that at. Uh, so kind of a planner. And then over here you have a little, looks like a little journal that comes with it. 
and it looks like just a small little booklet um, quick start guide daily habits weekly habits community seven journal principles which kind of reminds me of the seven habits of highly effective people um, but these are totally different <laughs> I guess seven's just a magical number um, and the 13 week wall calendar uh, so you we've included a 13 week wall calendar in your self journals box so I'm wrong so maybe it does have a 13 week calendar it does have a 13 week calendar so that's kind of cool so let's see this says this was what was in the picture uh, it looks like you hang it up on the wall each row is a different week and over here it simply says day 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 so that's one two three four five six seven days and 13 weeks down here you can put a reward for yourself and here's your 13 week goal which kind of is an unlucky number right 13 although I say that all the time and then I mentioned my friend Camila loves the number 13 she's not afraid she lives on the 13th floor which is easy for me to remember which apartment is hers when I go there um, all right here's the journal it has this nice little uh, yellow binder journal closer and it's yellow on the inside it says self journal journal you put your name address phone number and email and it has that quick start guide and it looks like it wants you to go to bestself.co slash get started it must have some video instructions there uh, it looks like you can join a community and it has some more pdf downloads and it has 13 weeks which is perfect to coincide with the 13 weeks that you get here in this wall calendar so inside of here it kind of looks like every week every day is exactly the same so you get one day for I guess a two page spread I should say for each day so over here you have six o'clock through nine o'clock and you have things I am grateful for notes and ideas which is a grid format and then you have my goal today's target uh, you get a quote you get lessons learned which is your opportunities you get wins and then it says tonight I am grateful for you so you get a little reminder there for gratitude so it looks exactly the same each day except the um, the quote has changed and then finally when you get to the end uh, you just get a one pager that says congratulations you did it and here at the end you get some blank pages that are uh, again that dot grid so the whole thing is numbered so it's a total of 240 pages and the back is just yellow and I'm guessing there should be some goal setting in the front yes kind of um, so oh yeah so it looks like you get an unnumbered undated month so we talked about this before about creating undated planners I think this is an excellent idea uh, because it doesn't matter when someone buys this they can buy it whenever um, in week one week two they're all exactly the same but basically you write down your weekly milestones and it looks like maybe you write some major tasks for those each day of the week Saturday and Sunday are clumped together and then over here you have habit activities goal and then a check mark for each day of the week and then it looks like at the end you tally it up and then it asks, what is the happiest event that happened this week? So this looks more like a week in review. I guess you must fill this side out afterwards. Um, and then what were your three big wins for the week? And review your goal and assess your progress. How did you spend your time this week? How will you improve next week? What was the biggest lesson you learned this week? And then this tracking. So it just looks like it makes it dark. So you can kind of see where you're at. So obviously here you're at week six and then you can see the, the rest are grayed out. So I think this is cute do and I actually prefer um, lately I used to love the round coil bindings but lately I've really liked this uh, type of binding better the stitch binding and it just seems a little more high-end and my coils just keep getting broken every time in my bag because I have so much stuff inside of there so I think these are great I think they're definitely worth it would I have paid the extra six dollars I think it is for it to get it from best self itself no I love the packaging from Amazon and it arrived way faster and it looks pretty much the same so uh, let me know in the comments below what you think and if you have a self journal or if there's another type of journal that you like instead all right